Can you imagine Tesla producing a semi-truck in just 10 to 15 minutes? That's the goal for next year when the Giga Semi factory officially launches. While this is Tesla's most challenging vehicle to manufacture, the new facility makes this rapid production speed entirely achievable. 2025 is set to be a major turning point, with semi-truck production expected to skyrocket, targeting at least 10,000 units by the end of the year. Tesla is even aiming for 50,000 units in 2026, though that goal might be a stretch. One thing is certain, at least 10,000 Tesla semis will hit the road by the end of this year, fulfilling long-standing customer orders. Elon Musk has repeatedly emphasized that companies not using the Tesla Semi are missing out on massive profits. With unmatched efficiency, fuel savings, and reduced maintenance costs, the Semi isn't just a truck, it's a money-making machine. The best part? It's about to become available to a broader range of customers, and it's fully customizable to fit specific needs and budgets. Early adopters have already praised its incredible performance, and if all goes according to plan, the Tesla Semi could dominate the trucking industry by 2026, shattering the myth that electric trucks can't replace diesel ones. Get ready for some exciting updates on this game-changing vehicle. While we wait for the Giga Semi factory to be completed by the end of this year, Giga Nevada is already producing a small number of Tesla Semis. Evidence of this can be seen in the numerous new semis spotted outside the facility, as captured by Henrik Zane over the past year. These trucks are likely being used internally by Tesla to transport batteries from Fremont rather than being delivered to pre-order customers. Elon Musk has confirmed that production of the first semis will begin no later than Q4 this year, with the possibility of starting as early as Q3 if everything stays on track. The new factory, spanning 4 million square feet and backed by a $3.6 billion investment, is approximately 65% complete. Recent updates show Tesla speeding up construction, particularly in the stamping pit area, where large machines will be installed. Workers, excavators, and compactors are actively preparing the site, with foundational layers of soil and cement already in place. Henrik Zane predicts we'll soon see footage of the stamping areas along with the installation of manufacturing equipment in various sections of the factory. Additionally, the relocation of propane storage tanks suggests heating-related work is underway. There's also speculation that Tesla might produce the robo-van at the new factory. While gigacasting machines will be installed, it's unlikely they'll be used for semi-production, as these trucks are mostly hand-built. However, if the robo-van is produced here, a gigacasting machine could be justified, especially if production volumes are high. The robo-van, unveiled at Tesla's October event last year, is a fully autonomous vehicle designed to carry up to 20 people. Elon Musk has highlighted its potential to address high-density transportation needs, with operating costs as low as $0.05 cents to $0.10 cents per mile. While mass production is expected next year, its launch might be delayed as Tesla prioritizes the cybercab. In other news, Elon Musk recently welcomed his 13th child, sparking widespread discussion and even jokes about Tesla releasing a new truck to accommodate his growing family. The satirical outlet The Babion humorously suggested a Model H homeschooler truck, to which Musk responded with an image of the robo-van, captioning it, We think this is for... This playful exchange has only added to the excitement around Tesla's upcoming vehicles. Back to the Semi, Tesla has been expanding its supercharger network, but megachargers for the Semi remain limited. Despite repeated funding denials from the Biden administration, Tesla recently revealed plans to build a Semi-megacharger station in Southern California. A permit application filed with Los Angeles County outlines plans for 12 charging stations, marking the first public land installation for Tesla semis. As production ramps up, we can expect more megachargers to support the growing fleet. The Tesla Semi is priced between $180,000 and $250,000, which might seem steep compared to diesel trucks costing $120,000 to $150,000. However, the long-term savings are undeniable. Operating costs are just $0.85 cents per mile, compared to $1.51 for diesel trucks, and maintenance costs are significantly lower. Tesla estimates that businesses could save up to $200,000 over three years by switching to the semi. 
Companies like PepsiCo and DHL have already seen these benefits firsthand and have no plans to return to diesel. Tesla is also making strides with the second generation Semi, which will feature the advanced 4,680 battery cells, offering higher energy density and improved efficiency. This next-gen model will include a sleeper cab for long-haul drivers and other design upgrades to enhance the driving experience. With a target of producing 50,000 semis annually, Tesla is poised to make a significant impact on the trucking industry. The semi's performance is equally impressive. Real-world tests have shown it can travel 1,076 miles with just two charging stops and complete a 500-mile trip on a single charge while hauling cargo. Its tri-motor setup allows it to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 20 seconds, even with a full load, and can climb steep grades at 60 miles per hour, something diesel trucks can't match. Advanced safety features, including traction control and rollover protection, further set apart. Charging time is another area where the Semi excels. With Mega Charger technology, it takes just 40 minutes to fully charge, aligning perfectly with mandatory driver brakes. While diesel trucks refuel faster, federal driving regulations mean they don't actually move any quicker in real-world operations. Beyond financial and operational benefits, the Tesla Semi is a game-changer for the environment. Heavy-duty trucks account for just 1% of vehicles, but are responsible for 20% of global emissions. Transitioning to electric trucks is a critical step toward reducing pollution and building a sustainable transportation industry. With countries like those in Europe and states like California pushing for zero emission mandates, diesel trucks could become a rarity within the next decade. The Tesla Semi isn't just an electric truck, it's a technological leap that redefines performance, efficiency, and sustainability. For businesses still relying on diesel trucks, the shift to electric isn't just an option, it's a necessity to stay competitive. The future of transportation is here, and the Tesla Semi is leading the charge. Are you ready to embrace the change? Let me know if you'd like further adjustments.